In today's video, I want to invite you to consider a new way to bring awareness to your life by observing what other people say about you and then making a choice to take back your power. So let's take any situation and observe what other people are saying to us in that situation. For our example, let's take the example of starting a new job. And during the first day, you may have a number of interactions. Um, your boss will greet you when you arrive. And as he takes you to your desk, say for example, that he says the following, this is a challenging role. You've got your work cut out. At another point in the day, you're talking to someone in your team and they say the following, this work is nothing to get excited about. It's really quite dull. And then just before you leave for the day, the person that you're sitting next to turns to you and they confide in you the following, just so you're aware, it can be tough to get things done around here. So that is a rather plausible situation that could occur on someone's first day in a new job. But what I want to invite you to do is rather than considering the thoughts that were spoken by the other employees, by the boss and the two colleagues, I want to invite you to consider them as not independent thoughts from those people, but in fact, re revealing to you your own thoughts. All is consciousness and we are all one. So the thoughts um, and the opinions of others spoken to us in effect reflect our own thinking um, and often our own fears. So for this example, the three thoughts, the three considerations given by the other employees are actually revealing the individual who is starting their job's beliefs. So they may be believing that the role will be challenging. They're fearful and consider that it's going to be a tough role for them. They also fear it being dull and not very exciting for them. It's not going to be enjoyable for them to do the role. And then the final point um, and fear that this person seems to have is that they're anxious that it'll be hard to get things done in the job. So this is a reframing um, that is very helpful for us to take seriously. And when we reframe the thoughts that others speak to us in this way, we are taking back our responsibility in our imagination and in our consciousness. It removes us from the place of victim in this world and we become truly the transforming power in our lives. This is very, very important. So I encourage you to take this reframe um, often in your day and recognize the power of your own consciousness and transform those thoughts to what you truly and ideally want them to be. James Allen says the following um, in his book, As a Man Thinketh, circumstance does not make the man, it reveals him to himself. Make this a part of your life and transform your circumstances um, as a response to this. That's all for today. Um, please subscribe uh, to learn more about my thoughts on consciousness and personal transformation and freedom. Um, I hope you're enjoying the channel and the videos that I'm putting out. Um, please comment uh, with thoughts and ideas for what you'd like to hear more about as well. It's been great talking to you today and I'll speak to you again soon.